everybody. Good afternoon. Thank you. Welcome to our Baby and Family Fair Little Ones Music Play class um, hosted by Tallahassee Memorial Healthcare this morning. Thank you guys for joining. My name is CL. I'm the Medical Music Therapy Director here at TMH and we are so excited for you all to join us this morning. Um, we're going to go ahead and just dive right into some of our music activities. Um, this class is intended to be um, a class for our little ones and our parents to engage with their little ones. So for anybody that's out there this morning, I'll provide you all a little bit of examples of how you can engage with your little ones. We're going to start with hello, so you can encourage them to wave. You can wave to themselves, to me on the screen. They can wave to siblings, dad, mom, caregiver, grandma, whoever is around this morning. So let's get started. Hello, hello, it's music time. Hello, hello, it's music time. Hello, hello, it's music time. It's time to say hello. Let me see those pretty waves. Hello, everybody. Hello, friends, can you wave hello? Hello, big waves. Hello, friends, can you wave hello? All right, is anybody else around that you can wave hello to? Maybe let's start with our moms this morning. Hello, moms, can you wave hello? Hello, hello, mom, can you wave hello? And if we have any dads out there this afternoon, feel free to say hello to them too. Hello, dad, can you say hello? Hello, dad, can you wave hello? The last one we'll do is siblings. Any siblings, brother or sisters or family members out there, you can wave hello or you can give them a high five. Hello, brother or hello, sister. Hello, brother, I'll give you a high five. High fives, awesome. Hello, hello, last time it's music time. Hello, hello, it's music time. Hello, hello, it's music time. It's time to say hello. Hi, everybody. It's so good to be with you this afternoon and this Monday, the start of our week. I hope you guys had fun saying hello to me, Miss Ciel, or your friends, or anybody that is with you this morning. So between all of our activities, we like to use a sign for all done. So we'll put our hands together and we'll say, all done, hello, all done, hello, all done, hello. It's time for something new. And actually, you saw me using some signs. We're going to go into a sign song to learn a little bit of signs. My recommendation for parents and givers with um, using baby sign language in the midst of them not having the verbal ability to communicate with us is just keeping the sign consistent. So even if you create your own sign to differentiate what something might mean, as long as you keep it consistent, um, that's really what our little ones are going to hold on to and be able to communicate with more. But I'm actually going to teach you a few this morning. So we're going to learn the sign for world. So we kind of make W's with our fingers and we just roll them around. So world, just like that. And if your little one's not able to, you can do hand over hand and assist them with kind of bringing their hands together to do that. So world, we're going to do a sign for book, just like you're opening it up right that book the sign for toy. So it's kind of, you put your thumb between your index and you shake it like a rattle, toy. The sign for music, you just swish like this across music. And the sign for baby. So we're gonna put those signs together in a song. So if you'll just follow me. My world, my world, books for reading in my world. My world, my world, books for reading in my world. Same thing, but toys. My world, my world, 
toys for playing in my world. Keep up that signing, my world, my world. Toys for playing in my world. Let's do that with songs for singing. My world, my world. Songs for singing in my world. My world, my world, songs for singing in my world. Last one, babies for loving. My world, my world, babies for loving in my world. My world, my world. Babies for loving in my world. Very nice signing, everybody. So those are just some simple signs that you can use around the house when you're talking about baby or asking if you want any music. Um, those are just some simple things that you can incorporate. All right, let's put our hands together and we say, all done signing, all done signing, all done signing. It's time for something new. So as you've seen, this is all done and this is the sign for new. All right, so next we're gonna make some music together. So if you have anything around the house that makes some noise, it can be a pot, a pan. Um, I have some shakers this morning, but you can also just get something hollow that maybe makes noise. This is my lollipop drum. So anything that you can make noise and use directions. Um, for those of our little ones out there that maybe aren't able to grasp just yet, our parents can help us hold it up or down, side to side, and assist us with that grasp. Um, but I also love to put something out in front of our little ones. That way they reach and practice that trunk stability as they're kind of working on those developmental milestones. So let's get started and sing something about playing some instruments. Here we go. Let's get a ready and razzle dazzle them. Let's get a ready and razzle dazzle them. Let's get a ready and razzle dazzle, razzle dazzle now. We're going to start with way up high. Can you put your instrument or whatever noise you're making all the way up high? Razzle it way up high up here. Razzle it to the sky. Razzle it way up high, razzle dazzle now. After we go up high, we come down low by our toes. Razzle it way down low, razzle it by your toes. Razzle it way down low, razzle dazzle now. Very good. I can hear you guys all the way from over here. I keep making that noise. Let's get ready and razzle dazzle and let's get go side to side practicing that swaying razzle them side to side razzle them side to side razzle them side to side razzle dazzle now now we're going to practice some directions razzle it very soft Shh. razzle it very soft Shh. that's right quiet razzle it very soft Razzle dazzle now. And the opposite of soft is loud. Let's hear that loud. Razzle it very loud. Razzle it very loud. Razzle it very loud. Razzle dazzle now. All right, now can we go slow like a turtle? Razzle it very slow, slow. Razzle it very slow good slow razzle it very slow razzle dazzle it now now we're gonna go fast 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 razzle it very fast faster faster razzle it very fast there you go razzle it very fast razzle dazzle now let's get ready yeah. Razzle dazzle them, let's get ready and Razzle dazzle them, let's get ready and Razzle dazzle them, 
one. Very nice. We say all done instruments. All done instruments. All done instruments. It's time for something new. All right, everybody. Now we're going to stand up because we're going to get some moving around. So I'm going to adjust my camera here so we can do some different movements. All right, we're going to stand. We're going to dance. We're going to have a lot of, oh, let's go a little bit higher so you can see me. All right, and anybody can dance along with us today, too. Okay, let's see. Whoa, see my strap came off. Give me one second, that's what happens sometimes. Here we go, now we got our guitar ready. Dance to the music, 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 dance till I say stop, freeze. You all freezing? Very good. We're going to jump to the music, 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 jump to I say stop, freeze. Is that some good jumping? Very nice. Now we're going to spin to the music, spin to the music, spin to the music, spin to the music. Spin to the music, spin to the music, spin till I say stop, freeze. Good freezing. What's next? We're going to stomp to the music, 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 stomp till I say stop, freeze. Good listening. Good freezing. Now we're going to bend to the music, 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 bend till I say stop, freeze. Good stopping. Can we sway next? Sway to the music, sway to the music, sway to the music, sway to the music. Sway to music, sway to the music, sway till I say stop, freeze. Good job. Say one more. We're gonna tiptoe to the music, 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 tiptoe till I say stop, freeze. Good freezing. We're gonna go back to our seats, 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 then we will sit down. Good moving everybody. We did some jumping, some stomping, lots of different things. So I always get out of breath after that one. Very good. So we say all done movement. All done movement, all done movement. It's time for something new. All right, everybody, if you all have any animals around, I want you to grab some animals. I have a dog today. Ooh, do you see that one? And a kitty cat. Let's see, do you know what this one is? Nice and green, it says ribbit, ribbit, a frog. And we have a duck. That says crack crack. So if you have any animals, you can get out your animals to make some noises. We're gonna sing first about our dog this morning. We're on our way, we're on our way, on our way to Grandpa's farm. Oh, we're on our way, we're on our way, on our way to Grandpa's farm. Down on Grandpa's farm, here was a little brown dog. Down on Grandpa's farm, there was a little brown dog. The dog, he makes a sound like this. Woof, woof. Can you do that? Woof, woof. The dog, he makes a sound like this. Woof, woof. Very nice. We're on our way, we're on our way, on our way to Grandpa's farm. Oh, we're on our way, we're on our way, on our way to Grandpa's farm. Ooh, next I have a black kitty cat. 
Down on Grandpa's farm there was a little black cat. Down on Grandpa's farm there was a little black cat. The cat, she makes the sound like this. Meow, meow. The cat, she makes the sound like this. Meow, meow. Very good cat. And next we have our little green frog. The frog, he makes the sound like this. Ribbit, ribbit, the frog, he makes the sound like this. Ribbit, ribbit, very nice. We're on our way, we're on our way, on our way to Grandpa's farm. Oh, we're on our way, we're on our way, on our way to Grandpa's farm. Let's do two more animals. Down on Grandpa's farm, there was a little yellow duck. Down on Grandpa's farm, there was a little yellow duck. The duck. She makes the sound like this. Quack, quack. The duck, she makes the sound like this. Quack, quack. And we have one more down on Grandpa's farm. There was a little blue shark. Ooh, down on Grandpa's farm. There was a little blue shark. The shark, he makes the sound like this. Chomp, chomp. The shark, he makes the sound like this. Chomp. Chomp. I know some sharks say do do too. We're on our way, we're on our way, on our way to Grandpa's farm. Oh, we're on our way, we're on our way, on our way to Grandpa's farm. Good animals, everybody. If anybody has animals at home, that's a great way to learn and just start vocalizing and practicing different animal sounds between woof and meow or m moo. So those are fun ways to kind of engage in that vocalization and using a song to go along with it. All right, so we'll say all done animals, all done animals, all done animals. It's time for something new. All right, everybody, next we're gonna get out a book this morning. So my book is Brown Bear, Brown Bear. And during our book, if our caregivers are out there, I always like to provide a nice steady beat as we go along with the book. That really helps with that rhythmic entrainment of speech, but it also helps our little ones get focused and kind of stay calm or calm down with that nice tactile input. So just kind of padding along to the beat as we go. All right, I'm sure some of you have this book at home too. Here we go. Brown bear, brown bear, what do you see? I see a red bird looking at me. Red bird, red bird, what do you see? I see a yellow duck. Wow, looking at me. Yellow duck, yellow duck, what do you see? I see a blue horse looking at me. Blue horse, blue horse, what do you see? I see a green frog looking at me. Green frog, green frog, what do you see? I see a purple cat looking at me. Purple cat, purple cat, what do you see? I see a white dog looking at me. White dog, white dog, what do you see? I see a black sheep looking at me. Black sheep, black sheep, what do you see? I see a goldfish, ooh, looking at me. Goldfish, goldfish, what do you see? I see a teacher looking at me. Teacher, teacher, what do you see? I see children. Wow, look at all those children looking at me. Children, children, what do you see? I see all the animals. That's what I see. Very good book, everybody. We saw lots of animals in there and even the teacher. So we say, all done book, all done book, all done book. It's time for something new. 
All right, everybody. Next, we're going to do some body parts. So for our little ones out there that know their body parts, we're going to start with our head. So you can point to your head and find your head. For those little ones that need a little bit of help or don't have body part recognition just yet, our caregivers and helpers can kind of help either model on themselves or have their little ones put hand over hand on their body parts. Let's start with our heads this morning. We're going to sing together. We say, my hand on my head, what have I here? This is my top notcher, my mama dear. Top notcher, top notcher, dickery do. That's what I learned in my school. Boom, boom. Oh, very nice. Now let's find our eyes. Where are your eyes? Right here. My hand on my eyes, what have I here? This is my eye blinker, my mama dear. Eye blinker, eye blinker, top notcher, top notcher, dickery do. That's what I learned in my school. Boom, boom, very nice. Now, where is our nose? Can you show me your nose? Did you find it? Right here, very good. My hand on my nose, what have I here? This is my smell sniffer, my mama dear. Smell sniffer, smell sniffer. Eye blinker, eye blinker. Top notcher, top notcher, dickery do. That's what I learned in my school. Boom, boom. All right, next we're coming to our mouth. My mouth right here. My hand on my mouth. What have I here? This is my food grinder, my mama dear. Food grinder, food grinder, smell sniffer, smell sniffer, eye blinker, eye blinker, top notcher, top notcher, dickery do. That's what I learned in my school. Boom, boom. Next, I want you to find your bellies. Where's your bellies this morning? My hand on my belly. What have I here? This is my bread basket, my mama dear. Bread basket, bread basket, food grinder, food grinder, smell sniffer, smell sniffer, eye blinker, eye blinker, top notcher, top notcher, dickery do. That's what I learned in my school. Boom, boom. That's what I learned in my school. Boom, boom. Very nice. And we could have kept going down all our body parts today, but we'll stop at our tummy this morning. So we say, all done body parts, all done body parts, all done body parts. It's time for something new. Very good. All right. So for our next song, I'm getting my frogs ready. I'm going to need some help counting. Can you show me five fingers? Five fingers on your hand. Ooh, can you get it up nice and high? You can show it to the camera. Very good. Say, look what I Oh, ooh, we have one, two, three, four, five frogs. So we're going to sing about five frogs together and see if we can count them. We say, five green and speckled frogs sitting on the speckled log, eating the most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool, Whoop, splash, where it was nice and cool. Now there are one, two, three, four green speckled frogs, four froggies. Four green and speckled frogs sitting on the speckled log, eating the most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool, Oop, splash, where it was nice and cool. Now there are one, two, three green speckled frogs. Only three left, show me three, very good. Three green and speckled frogs sitting on the speckled log, eating the most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool. Whoop, splash. Where it 
was nice and cool. Now there are one, two green speckled frogs. Only two, two left. Two green and speckled frogs sitting on the speckled log, eating the most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool. Splash! Where it was nice and cool. Now there is one a green speckled frog. Just one left. One green and speckled frog. Sitting on the speckled log. Eating the most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool. Splash! Where it was nice and cool. Now there are no green speckled frogs. They all jumped in. That was some good counting, everybody. We went from five, four, three, two, one frog to no frogs. Very good. We say all done counting. All done counting. All done counting, it's time for something new. All right, everybody, so we're gonna do a little bit of colors this afternoon. So I'm gonna bring out some colors and I want you to see if you can find anything in your area that is that color. So our first color this morning, does anybody know which one this is? Starts with an O, it's orange. Can you find anything orange? And caregivers out there, if there's anything that you can find that's orange to show your little one, you can just point to it and tell them orange for that color recognition. All right, let's sing about our orange color today. Orange, orange, I know this is orange. Orange, orange, see what I can do. Very good. Orange, everyone. Should we do more colors? So I always like to use the sign more because it's a very common one that little ones will use to reference more food, more milk, more anything that they might want. So let's do some more colors. Let's see. We have the color. What color is this? Green. Can you find something green around the house? Let's see. Green. Green. I know this is green, 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 see what I can do. Ooh, good green. Should we do one more color? Let's do more colors. Say one more. What about b -b blue? Any blue colors out there? Can you find one? Let's see blue, blue. Blue, I know this is blue. Blue, blue, see what I can do. Very nice blue, everyone. And you can show any other color that you want at home that you might have. Colors, colors, I can name my colors. Colors, colors, you can do it too. Very good colors, everyone. That one's always fun to find different colors around the house and just point to them, have them reach for it, and practice some of that color identification. All right, so we say all done colors, all done colors, all done colors. It's time to say goodbye. All right, everybody, we're gonna sing our song. It's time to go with some accompanying signs all together. And then I'll just close off by telling you all a little bit about our little ones music play class and about some upcoming um, baby and family fair activities. So we'll do it's time to go all together. And it goes like this. It's time to go. It's time to go. Will you wave goodbye? Will you wave goodbye? It's time to go. It's time to go. Will you wave goodbye and say goodbye? 
Bye, everybody. Thank you all for joining us this afternoon for our Little Ones Music Play class. Typically, these classes, um, we actually are able to see the little ones and the little ones are able to see each other. Um, we hold these classes every Friday morning at 9.30 a.m. Um, we'll be sharing some more information about that, but we'll actually be having another virtual group next Monday as well also at 12 o'clock via Zoom, and also take a look out for all of the other baby and family fair activities that are going to be going on. There are lots of things out there, lots of great resources, so we hope that you also engage in those um, because they're a great resource for you and your little ones. So thank you all so much for joining us today, and hopefully we'll see you guys again soon. Have a good one.